Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So in this video, what we're going to be doing is enabling ICMP echo request from our gateway, which is at 10.2.21.1. So at the moment, we'll test it. We're not able to ping it. We're not able to get to it. And this is default on, uh, this is default, uh, on any firewall that you want to drop those packets just for security reasons. So if you guys are new to the channel, please like, subscribe, and share. And if you're coming back for some fun, let's have some fun. So we're gonna do a, a little before and after the fact. I am logged into my Windows 11 VM. <clears throat> and let me go ahead and bring up the topology just to show you guys. So let me just bring this bigger. All right. So here we have our checkpoint gateway, which is the LAN interface, ETH0, is at 10.2.21.1, okay? So by default, this is gonna block any kind of ping request, any kind of ICMP request. So let's go ahead and minimize this. On our Windows, uh, let's do, uh, on our Windows 11 machine, let's see if we can ping dot one, right? It's gonna say womp, 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 it's not going to be able to ping. So let me just break that and let me try to do dot two, which is the management. Okay. So we are able to ping dot two, but not dot one. So let's go ahead and fix that. You can create, you know, different kind of rules uh, in, you could create different kind of policies, but what we're going to do, we're going to go ahead and go to up here to the menu. We're going to go to global properties. In global properties, you have the firewall global properties. And we can see all these different kinds of uh, options, right? So down here, you see accept ICMP request. Let's go ahead and click on that. You see it says before last, obviously. So the last um, rule is like, it dies if you, if, if you put it, uh, it's an implicit rule. All right, so let's go ahead and hit okay here. As you can see here, we have one, diff, uh, one new change that we have to publish. Let's go ahead and publish this change to take effect on our firewall. Let's go ahead and come back up here. So once that's up, we're gonna go ahead and install the policy. And let's go ahead and install because we're pending that one change. And I think these little, you know, these little uh, configurations are important uh, just because you know, if you're troubleshooting, oh, I can't ping my gateway and all that stuff. So you can go ahead and click on here, details, and you can see it's pretty quick. Uh, mine is successful, it did succeed. So now let's go ahead and test our gateway. Now we can ping because we are allowing those ICMP packets to traverse from our Windows 11 machine to the gateway. All right, so, I think that was an important video to make. If you guys are having this problem in the real world, say for example, you just set up a firewall, you know, and you found this video helpful, obviously give me a thumbs up. And if you're following along, you know, if everything works, give us a thumbs up as well. And if you have any questions, any problems, let me know in the comments below. And until next time, folks, have an awesome day. And until, you know, if you have, until next time, have a good day. That's what I meant. All right, have a good one. Take care, guys.